to my channel my name is Desiree if you are new here thank you for stopping by greatly appreciate it and today is Thursday today is Thursday April the 13th and I'm just now turning on the camera for this week I y'all the past few days like literally right after Easter I started to feel just like I don't know out of, I just haven't been in the mood and I don't know if you guys ever feel like that where you kind of like, you, you know, you were on a high, you were like, okay, I'm accomplishing goals and doing this and doing that. And then it's like, boom, you hit like a plateau or you just lose motivation. We, I've been so tired all over the place. I just feel like I haven't really been like myself. I feel like I've been kind of like just lacking motivation and energy and just like, just a hot mess basically and so I couldn't I couldn't turn on the camera <laughs> the past few days because I was just a mess I was literally like I can't this morning I literally was like Desiree you have to get up you can't just be laying in bed you know you know lacking motivation I need to go to the gym get my steps in I need to work out I need to hit the the Stairmaster I did not, unfortunately, I missed three days of my walking challenge and Easter, I was with family, so I just really couldn't. I was at church and with my family. And then second, I couldn't, um, on Monday, I didn't reach it because I was so busy at work. By the time I got home, y'all, I was so tired and then the same thing yesterday. So no more excuses. I, I, was, I missed three days of this challenge, but I'm not going to let that deter me from my walking challenge and just trying to get 8,000, between 8,000 and 10,000 steps. So yeah, I'm going to take you all along with me for a few days in my life as I try to get out of this funk or whatever I'm experiencing. But I have a lot of things I got to get done. I got to be productive. I got to work out. I just got to basically restart because I ain't going to lie. April kind of started with a little whoo. It was here and I was like, I'm not prepared. So right now it is 11.55 and I'm making me a very late, I guess you can say brunch. I'm making me some brunch because I literally woke up late and then I started cleaning and then I started trying to figure out what I need to get done today. So on the agenda today, I need to eat breakfast, which I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna go to the gym. I need to wash my hair. This is an old silk press. I'm really, really proud of how I took care of my hair and how I took care of my silk press. And so just really, really proud of myself. So yeah, I need to wash my hair later because girl, y'all, my hair is dirty. I gotta wash it. So I'm gonna wash my hair. Then I might go clean my car, maybe not but I also have to do a lot of things on the computer. I think I mentioned it in my previous blog, which was my life after grad school blog, episode four. And I talked about doing an online professional development class and you get a certificate. So I need to work on the homework, but I'm gonna finish cooking. I gotta talk to my mom and I will check in with y'all in a little bit.
jobs. It happens with even jobs. It happens with business. Sometimes you want to quit the business. Life is so tough. But everything is seasonal. And that's the encouragement of life. God never wants your circumstances. He doesn't want you to deny them. A storm is a storm. You don't call it a sunshine day. A storm is reality. But he never wants your circumstance to trump his word. <clears throat> been some time later it's currently 4 41 and i just got done um making a applying for my real california id so i took care of that made a dm dmv appointment so i'm just waiting what's going on yeah so i did that that was like on my number my number <laughs> The number one thing on my to-do list today was to get that done so I feel really accomplished. As I was saying, I just got done filling out the application for the uh, signing up for the California Real ID. I think every state's going to have where people who live in that state have to apply for like a real ID as they call it. I mean, I guess. Took care of that, and then I scheduled a DMV appointment because I do have to go inside and um, take a DMV picture. So I took care of that. Um, so I'm gonna do that at the end of the month. So I took care of that, and then now what I'm going to do is finish planning for the remainder of this month. I just have a few things that I want to put in my calendar because I haven't had time to like really just sit down and plan out some things. I did send out a few emails. Sorry if the lighting's like super bright. I did send out some emails. So I just had to send out some emails and different things like that. Yeah, so I'm just going to sit here and finish doing some work and I will check in with you all in a little bit. Good morning, y'all. Today is Saturday and I am up and at it again to go to the gym. Y'all see the consistency? Y'all see the consistency? So it's actually currently, it's almost, it's actually 11 11. Make a wish, make a wish. But yeah, it's 11 o'clock and I am about to head to the gym. I am going to try to do the Stairmaster for 30 minutes. And then my goal today is to walk at least or get 9,000 steps in. And then when I come home, I need to do the clothes, fold my clothes that's on my bed. I need to fold my clothes. And then I need to, what else do I need to do? I need to work on my class homework that I did not finish yesterday. I want to complete a whole module at least to between today and tomorrow. So I'm going to work on that a little bit. So that's going to be on the to-do list. And then I also need to work on a job application. I actually am working on two job applications kind of like at the same time. So I'm going to be working on the supplemental questions today. But yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing y'all today. Not a whole lot going on, but I'm just trying to be productive. You know, I'm trying to regroup from the last earlier last week because earlier last week I was a hot mess so I'm trying to bounce back from that situation so all right y'all I'm gonna talk with you all once I get back from the gym and yeah I just need to get this day started so peace out <laughs>
what's up y'all happy sunday it's the next day and i look a mess please excuse my hair and just the way i look i literally just threw on anything and it's because i still got a few more things to get done that i didn't get done off of my to-do list yesterday I on them a little bit when i was downstairs um watching the warriors game with my uh dad unfortunately the warriors lost and the kings won the first playoff game but it's okay it's okay hopefully the warriors will come back strong and win the whole series but yeah after the game i just kind of got lazy and just chilled out with my uh, parents and sister downstairs and yeah before I knew it I had to finish folding clothes off my bed and then I got in the bed to go to, to go to sleep so here I am it's 808 .08 currently and I made some coffee and I'm going to sit here before I go to the 11 a.m. service at my church. So I'm just gonna sit here and try to get as much stuff done as possible. <sighs> yeah, I have a lot of things to do and no energy really to do them. And I have work tomorrow and I feel like I have low key the Sunday scaries <laughs> because I feel like I could have done a lot more this weekend. I. I feel like this every weekend y'all like every like weekend I'm like oh I could have done a lot more for this we could have done a lot more of that but honestly it is what it is life is too short to be stressing about things that I could have should have done either I didn't do it and I move forward and try to get them done and that's just the mindset I gotta have you know it is what it is so I'm gonna use my little latte to do list to finish up um, my remainder to do list for this weekend and then prepare for uh this upcoming week so so i'm gonna go ahead and end today's video make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it comment down below what was one thing that you accomplished this week that you were super proud of comment down below i want to hear what you guys accomplished this week was it a productive week for you was it a non-productive week for you did you take it easy comment down below chit chat with me in the comments and i will definitely respond i hope you guys are doing well make sure you check out all my other videos and get caught up if you haven't already done so and i will see you guys in the next one bye Thank you.